Hello, I am Anil from Everex. Everex is very proud to be associated with Perfint in introducing this wonderful piece of robotics in Australia and New Zealand. Everex has just completed its first Robio EX install in the Alfred Hospital in Melbourne, which is one of the most prestigious and premier institute in interventional radiology in Australia. This project was carried out under the esteemed guidance of Professor Ken Thompson and with a very positive feedback from him and his team, we are pretty sure of Robio EX success in Australia and New Zealand. The procedure we're doing today is a nerve root injection and it's pretty simple. This is a patient who has a nerve root compromised from a disc and what we're going to do today is put a needle down into the nerve root and inject a mixture of local anaesthetic which will take out the pain and a steroid which will take out the inflammation. This is done in a CT scanner and the CT scanner shows us the path that we have to get to. The issue with putting needles in in CT is that Sometimes the path isn't straightforward, and if it's a compound path in terms of going from a different area other than straight above the, the lesion, you have to come in from an angle, and sometimes it's a compound angle in two directions, which is very difficult to visualize yourself. The advantage of Robio is that Robio works out these difficult compound angles for us. So all I have to do is tell Robio where I want to get to, and where I wanted to start from, and he does all the rest. He positions himself exactly over the right spot on the skin, so I can put in local anaesthetic, and then tells me exactly how far in to put the needle, and I put the needle straight in in one swift movement, which causes less pain and discomfort for the patient. And once I've done that, Robio's done his job. We then confirm the position of the needle by doing some more CT scans of the tip of the needle and so far it's been within a millimeter of where we wanted it. Uh, it's quite remarkable, it, it's taken all of the complexity and difficulty out of placing needles and CT anywhere in the body. So we're going to select our target point over here and I'm just going to have another look. Yeah, I think that's where I would like to finish the needle and click there. The entry point at the skin is the next selection and we could sort of head up and make an angled approach but I think we'll stay on the same slice and set the entry point and that's quite a nice direction right there. So that's our selection. We've got, our, we've got to set our needle length. We use a 127 millimeter needle with the system. And then okay, the system will then ask you to make sure that you know where you're going. And uh, it actually corrects as well. So the external length is already accommodated for so that you end up exactly where you want with the final point. We'll use a local anesthetic needle just to give some nice anesthesia to the soft tissue components. Usually try and get as much of the muscle down as we can. We don't often have that, but we can do that today. Confirming the trajectory, and we're happy with that. Yes, it's on the skin surface. Double check that, and we're ready to go. The beauty of the Robio EX is that every registrar who does nerve root injections is now as good at doing them as I am. So we've upskilled the whole department just with one device. This is, a, I think, a good case for the Robio because you've got a very tight window, about maybe one or two millimeters either side where you've got some space. So having it actually guide us at least to the very target point in this patient was very handy because you've got perfect angle. You know where you're going to anesthetize and we had a guy. In this patient, she actually moved very slightly so that we ended up very near that lip. But it was easy to make that adjustment because we already had our perfect angle so we could just come back, slide in. And I actually knew the depth perfectly because the uh, holder was there. The length was 112. 
millimeters in this setting. And inserted with robotic guidance, check scan was done, needle position was confirmed by the check scan, and then contrast was injected. Follow medication for the referring physicians, and then we'll press OK and send off that report. And that uh, will generate our report for us that we could utilize um, and transfer to the PAC system if we needed to. The Robio just takes standard CT scans and has a very simple, straightforward interface to allow you to plan the path of each needle. And it's, it's just revolutionizing the way we're doing our CT procedures.